Uh, Megan, what do we have going on, by the way? There's a, a chamber event, which yes. is happening, which I love because I'm all about supporting stuff that happens from here. Yes. And that's what this is. This is all about that. Yeah. Um, actually, we're going to have some beer at that, too, because Fred Matt from the FX Matt Brewery in Saranac is on our panel. Okay, so nice, nice. I get to tell him what to do that day. <laughs> I'm sure you're going to love that. Yeah. <laughs> but it's a, a, what it's called is Manufactured in Our Backyard. It's happening on October 20th. And, you know, when people see the name, you know, you might be confused at what the, what the event actually is. So what we're doing is we've invited six panelists to join us, and they're going to bring all their products. So for the first hour, it'll be a cocktail hour. You'll get to touch and feel a lot of the products of these manufacturers, um, which I think is really important because I think we drive by people like Fountainhead. We drive by people like Indium. We don't know exactly what they do. Um, so these products will be on display for you to see. We've done a really good job with our beers, mm-hmm. with our food, Definitely. with all of that stuff. But you're right. There are so many products out there. I, I think that people w- will be shocked knowing that this stuff is like i mm-hmm. came across the um you mentioned fountainhead i think mm-hmm. the 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 bug uh the fogger yep <laughs> they they make the and black flag all the whenever you see black flag chances are it's coming from here definitely and pretty much every you know one of those pump sprayers that yep. you use to yep. fertilize your lawn or kill your weeds i mean all of those all that stuff is from here. from here yeah really really uh, cool so you'd be surprised to find out mm-hmm. that you're supporting local jobs when you spend money with these companies exactly i mean these these products are distributed i mean to home depots lowe's um par technology is going to be a part of it so every mcdonald's pretty much that you go to and you order your food you're ordering out of a par terminal Mm -hmm. um you know so just things like that that we you know we do a great job like you said of talking about our beer um, which fred's going to i think talk about some different things that they do with the product exporting and their involvement in other types of things like the brewers association um so you know you figure we talk you know they do you know they do saranac Mm -hmm. you know they do utica club and those things Mm -hmm. but it's all the other stuff that you would never even realize you don't know exactly and you know we we talk about chicken riggies and half moons and and greens but let's talk about some other things so so the goal really of the event is just to shed light on the manufacturing industry the second half will be a panel discussion where uh, Corey albright from the advanced institute for manufacturing aim um, which is a program out of mvcc He's going to be our moderator, so we're going to have um, six panelists. We'll, you know, cover everything from the history of their company, cool. pain points of them growing, you know, where their products get distributed. So even if you're not interested in, you know, nitty gritty manufacturing, it's it's basically an overview and. The goal is just so people can talk about it. Yeah, so when you yeah. talk about Utica, you can hit some of these points too while you're talking about the green. And, and just and in the last race. couple of months, we've talked, and I know this is this, but the, what they do down in uh, in Mohawk, there's that quick cut, mm-hmm. and they make that um, the thing you use to chop when you make uh, like egg and olive uh, or egg salad. Mm-hmm, the mm-hmm. Uh, the even out in Oneida, the stuff the the only American silver that is mm-hmm. uh, the, the flatware that's being made in the country mm-hmm, comes mm-hmm. from here exactly. and there's just so many things that we don't we just kind of overlook and don't even realize mm-hmm, mm-hmm. and then there's stuff beyond that like you're talking about that nobody yeah. would even know about definitely cool. when so. where how do they get there so all it's that? thursday october 20th it's okay. at hearts hill inn from 5 to 7 30 you can go right on greater utica chamber.org on um, this friday if you join our email list if you're not already a part of it make sure you go on and join we are going to be doing a special for that day it is national manufacturing day on friday cool. so tomorrow all morning right. Um, you'll get an email in your inbox if you're on our list. Make sure to look for that. Um, we're also offering a student discounted ticket at $20. So if uh, students are interested in coming, they can come enjoy as well. How many will you have there? Uh, How probably, many vendors? oh, vendors. So yeah. we'll have six. So six, six. panelists um, plus a couple sponsors. So Showing the stuff that they do. Yep. Cool. It'll be really cool. All right. You should all serve the deep purple. Uh, they'll love it. <laughs> Just one thing I have to know What was your old middle name? My old man. <laughs> oh, you had it <laughs> right. You had to give up. You had to give up your middle name for. I wish it was really exciting, but it was only Anne. Did you yeah. lose your middle name though? Yeah, I uh, lost it. The lady at the social security office was like, "Are you sure you don't want to keep Anne?" See like, what we no. did. Uh, we, was Anne. Yeah. <laughs> My daughter's name is Grace Elizabeth Leslie Keeler, and it's because. The my two boys had mm-hmm. an issue with one 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 name one one or the other, so I'm like, well, just give her give her two middle names. Yeah. And my wife says she is not going to have two middle names. That would be <laughs> terrible. Now I got to tell you, my daughter loves it. Yeah, it's exciting. It's, it's unique, you know. Yeah. It's kind of different. So yeah, All I right. wish it was something cool like Gladys or Gladys. <laughs> you know, Martha's some crazy big, middle name that I lost. Martha's a name coming back too. Yeah, yeah. Martha. All these names. Yeah. yeah. Okay, there, uh, Anne. <laughs> 
Uh, we appreciate it. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. Uh, all right. Got a break.